Hi, teacher. Hello, Maria. Eh, hoy vengo en camino de la carretera de Comalapa, pero yo creo que en unos 10 minutos lo más estaré ya en casa. Ok, perfect. But you are pero going voy a to... tratar de, de ir ahora. Ok, ok. Thank you. Ok. All right. Hi, Mayra. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you doing? Fine, thanks. Oh, nice. It's good to see you. I see that Thursday and Friday is difficult for the majority to get connected early. Friday, I mean, Thursday and Friday. Yes. I think they, they work late, right? Maybe. Maybe they work late. Yes, and the traffic. In the traffic. Maybe, or the traffic is terrible. Yeah, I imagine, I imagine. So in San Salvador, what time does the traffic stop? Maybe um, 20 minutes. 20, okay, but, but what time? I mean, what time you don't have any traffic? At 7 ah, p.m.? Maybe at noon? At noon, all right. At noon, there's a lot of traffic. Yes, and at mm -hmm. night. And at night. Mm -hmm. yeah. Until what time? At Sakewara, until what time, approximately? Mm, at 7 p.m.? Yeah, it's, it's in the night. Late. very late. It's very, very late. late. Yeah, yes. very late at night. Yeah. I remember when I lived in San Miguel, there was traffic, but only at no in the morning, at noon and in the afternoon. In the night. Uh -huh. No, in the afternoon, after six, not, I mean, there was no traffic. Oh, interesting. Yes. That was when I live in San Miguel. Now I don't live in San Miguel, so I don't, I don't know about traffic now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's good because I, I hate traffic. I hate traffic, believe me. <laughs> me too. And in my my case, I live in Lourdes. Yeah. So there is a place I, with traffic. No. Yes. If, yes. Um, Los Chorros. Oh, yeah. I remember. I always see this on the news. I always see Los Chorros and the street is like with a lot of traffic every day in the afternoon the and in the morning. Stop very, yeah. Yes. But supposedly, supposedly, right? This freeway. Is, has two lanes, right? Has four lanes. Tiene cuatro. Carriles. Este cuatro carriles. Is four lanes, right? Yeah. I mean, and you have yes. traffic. Yes. For example, today I stay in the traffic. Uh, maybe, como decir, casi two hours. Almost, almost two hours. Almost two hours. Oh my God, it's, it's crazy. It's today crazy. Today was crazy. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. I, I remember um, because my wife lives here in Hawaitike in Morazan. And I remember um, I live in San Miguel and she lives here in Hawaitike. So there was a time in which I traveled from San Miguel to Hawaitike all Fridays. And the problem mm -hmm. is that, and the problem is that the street uh, from San Miguel to, to El Amatillo was being fixed, was being repaired. Estaba siendo re, este, reconstruida. So uh, I remember I spent like two or three hours in traffic. <laughs> it was crazy. Incredible. Yes. 
Es el problema. Aquí en el aeropuerto están haciendo también unas carreteras, unos anillos. Pero yes, no... I remember. Sí. <laughs> Una hora para llegar. Y do you, do you, uh, uh, talking about this, talking, uh, talking about this, do you think it's necessary? I mean, that construction? It's necessary, what? Do you think this construction is necessary, the, the, the construction about El Anillo Periférico? Uh, do, you, do you think it's necessary? I feel, uh, I believe it's, it's necessary okay. because the road, the road, is bet is um between mm -hmm. um has um la libertad okay i i i ask you i ask you because uh i have i have gone to the airport many times and in the place where they are building this uh this a new periférico you i mean you never see traffic right i i have never seen traffic nunca he visto traffic that's why I ask if you feel it's necessary. I mean, if this is necessary. Yes, in horas, hours, hours, pico, como podemos decir? In the rush hour. In the rush hour. In the rush hour is necessary. Oh, uh, I see. The employees are, are, are a lot. Mm, okay, so yes. it's, it's necessary then. Good evening. Good evening. How are you doing? I'm fine, teacher. Oh, and nice. You? It's good to see you. I'm very well. Thank you. Thank you very much for asking. All right, everyone. So now, good evening, everyone. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. It's good to see you one day before the last. Okay. One day before the last. Un día antes del último del módulo. So it's good to see yes. you. Okay. It's good to see you. Bueno, verles. So let's start then with the class you, because, teacher. okay, let's start with the class because we have many activities, okay? So we will we'll try to advance. So let me pass the attendance in this moment, okay? Ada Patricia? Present. All right. Adriana? Present. All right. Ana Michelle? Present. Angela? Present teacher. Asalia. Present. Good evening. Good evening. Darwin. Present teacher. All right. Flor. Flor. Gloria. Here. All right. Carla. Present. Great. Margarita. Present. Good. Maria. All right, thank you. Ahora les mandaron a hacer el recordatorio siempre de la cámara y un mensajito en el grupo, ¿verdad? De la cámara encendida, ¿ok? So please, es, tomémoslo, tomémoslo en consideración. Let's take it in consideration, ¿ok? Margarita, set present, right? María. Present. Mayra. Present. Nelson. Ofelia. Ofelia. Here, teacher. Okay. Here, teacher. All right. Osmin. Here, teacher. Good evening. Rafael. Good evening, Rafael. Rosa. Sandra. Yancy. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Hello. teacher. Hello, good evening, Sandra. Okay, Sandra said good evening, right, Yancy? Here, teacher. Okay, Yancy. Present, teacher. All right. Present. All right. Zulma. Zulma and Miguel. Present teacher. Okay. Very good. Uh, siempre haciendo el recordatorio de la cámara, okay? Recuerden que la cámara debe estar encendida, okay? No lo, no lo pido yo, sino que siempre lo pide Insafor. Así que con la pena les digo, por favor, enciendan la cámara. Please turn on the camera, okay? Uh, mm -hmm. A no ser de que tal vez se les trabe el internet o cualquier otra situación, pero por lo tanto la cámara debe estar encendida, ¿ok? Please, okay. por favor, please. Ok, everybody, so let's start. I remember you have something pending for today, right? You have something pending for today. Am I right? ¿Estoy en lo correcto? Am I right? Yes or no? Yes, teacher. Yes. Ok, what, what, what do you have or what pending thing do you have? 
What pending activity do you have? What pending activity do you have? The same procedure. The same procedure of uh, of request. Uh, to request uh, permissions. Exactly. Exactly. Okay. You were you were supposed, right? I hope you did. You were supposed to write, okay, the procedure uh, to request a permission, okay? You were supposed to write the steps for the procedure to request a permission, okay? Did you do it, Luis Yeah. Yes? No, don't say no, yeah. please. <laughs> All right, so, okay, I like your sincerity. Okay, very good. So uh, the idea is that now that you have the procedure, because everybody, I suppose everybody has the procedure, and if you don't have it, I guess you have to come up with one, right? So the idea is that we go like three or four minutes. Now that you have the procedure, you go and practice the conversation and then we come and then you present to the class, okay? So let me see, uh, Mayra, do you have the procedure? Yes, teacher. Darwin? Okay, yes. Okay, thank you yes, very much. Teacher. Ana Michelle? Yes, I have. Yes, all right. Uh, Adriana? Mm, yes, teacher. All right, all right. What's me? Yeah, teacher, I am good. ready. Okay, good. Carla? Yes, teacher. All right, Miguel said no, but I think he's going to come up with one. Angela? No. no, okay. No. Tienen que pensar en uno, entonces. Tienen que sacárselo de la bolsa. Sí. You have to think yes, of one. Teacher. All right. Okay, very good. Honestamente, no, pero lo voy a hacer. Okay, uh, Jancy. Yes. Yes, Jancy. Yes, perfect. Zulma. Sorry, I can't hear the questions. Uh, the, the, the question is if you have the procedure. I, yesterday, at the end of the, of the class, I said, write a procedure to request a permission, right? Yes, did you write it? Ah, yes. Ah, okay, perfect. Yes. Okay, perfect, thank you. Gloria? Gloria, hello. Ah. Margarita? Hello. Yes, teacher, I okay. write the procedure. Okay. Perfect, okay, thank you very much. Procedure. All right, the procedure, okay, the yes. procedure. Very good, now listen, uh, so please. Ya. Yeah. Este, Patricia y yo tenemos problemas con el internet. Por favor, no, nos da ahí una disculpa, pero estamos intentando mantenernos en la clase. Okay, perfect. Okay, thank you for informing. Thank you, Gloria. Good. Uh, so please, uh, in this moment, you will go with the same pair. Okay, with the same pair. And, and uh, then... You will, um, okay, let me see if I have the pairs here. Yeah, I have the pairs here. I will give you like three or four minutes, okay? So practice the conversation in three or four minutes, and then we come here and you present to your classmates, okay? So let me see, Gloria is with Carla. Am I right? Yes, right? So Gloria and Carla, you are group number one. Number one. Group number two, Ada, Asalia, and Nelson. Number three. Miguel and Zulma. Number four, Flor and Margarita. Number five, Maria and Rafa. Maria and Rafa, okay? Number six, Ana and Angela. Number seven, Mayra and Rosa. Number eight, Osmin and Sandra. Number nine, Darwin and Ofelia. And number 10, Adriana and Jancy, all right? So, any doubt? Any question? Or clear? Everything is clear. Is everything clear? Yeah? Okay, perfect. So let's go then to practice. Yes, sir. Sorry? Teacher. Yeah. Eh, eh, María Estela. María. Lo único see. que yo no voy a poder. No voy a poder ahorita. Ah, okay. So who is your partner, María? Rafa, right? But Rafa, is Rafa connected yes. now? Yes, Rafa is connected. Rafa is not connected yet, I think. Lucky you. 
Rafa is not connected yet. I am yet. driving. Okay, but Rafa is not connected. Don't worry. Okay, so let's go then to okay. practice. So please, uh, go to the room I told you. Vayan a la sala que les indique. Go to the room I indicated, please. Teacher, I don't see uh, the room. Sorry? Sorry, Nelson. I don't see it. No veo el para conectar. ¿Dónde les aparece? Alguien que nos ayude porque yo no sé dónde les aparece a ustedes realmente. ¿Dónde les aparece el mensaje para que puedan entrar al equipo? Where does it appear? Ah, donde está sección de grupos. Ah, ok. Está, ¿dónde está la sección de compartir pantalla. En la barrita de abajo. Sección de grupos y ahí. Sex. Ahí, ahí aparece. aparece. Yes. Ok. Go to sección de grupos, then. Yes. Ok. Room 2. Room 2. Room 2. <laughs> sí, room 2, pero no lo mismo. Sorry, what happened, Miguel? Miguel, el no, micrófono. No lo veo. Perdón, 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 teacher. En el room 2 estaba Ada, por eso me salí. No, no. Room Ada two. me dijo que a ella sí, le toca. Yo estoy con Asale en el, en el room 2, pero no lo veo. No les aparece. It doesn't appear. Let me send you then. Let me send you. Let me send you. Room 2. Okay, okay. Room 2. No room number 2 for you, Miguel. Ah, ok. Zulma yes. también la veo aquí afuera. Ok. Y con ella me toca. Vamos Ahorita. al 2 entonces. No. Y sacamos a los que están ahí en el 2. <risa> no, en room 2 we have. Ahí está Ada en room 2 y ya sale ahorita. Por eso. Ajá, pero. Eh, usted me está diciendo que en el 2 y yo solo voy con, con Zulma. Ah, oh, I'm sorry. Entonces yo me he confundido. Ese. Está en, estás en el 3, tú, perdón. Veo. En el 3. El 3. No okay. me aparece. Y el 3. ¿No les aparece? Me parece. A ver, Nelson, te ayudo. Nelson, ¿a qué grupo? Eh, Osmin, ¿a qué grupo? Y con nada. Eh, number 8, teacher. Pero no number 8. Nelson, ¿a qué teacher. grupo? Nelson, ¿a qué grupo? Nelson, which group? Nelson, which group? Teacher. Si ya lo tengo lento el internet. Nelson, which room? Nelson. Nelson iba en el 2. Yo me metí ahí, pero no me toca a mí ahí. No, 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 no es que creo que fue que no pusieron atención cuando les dije, les dije, Gloria Ada, Nelson ven el 2. Ok, Nelson is in number 2. Ok, Nelson. No. Yes. Yo sí voy. You are going to number 2, Nelson. Number 2, Nelson. Ya revisé aquí. I check. You are with Ada en Asana. Yo iba en el 2. Yes. Uh, Zulma, which room? Eh, usted me dijo que en el 2, pero ahí estaba Ada. No, el, el, me tres. Me esperando. es el 3, Zulma. Es el 3, Zulma, perdón. Es number 3. Zulma y Miguel, ah. number 3. Ok. Again. Okay. Gracias. Flor María, are you going to participate? María Estela, Ofelia, ¿van a participar en la actividad? Yes, teacher. ¿En qué número voy, teacher? Ay, que están dormidos. Se me tienen que poner las pilas. Ok. Ofelia va al número... 9. Let me see here. Nine, number nine. Okay, okay, teacher. En el nueve. Flor, ¿va a participar en la actividad? Sorry, teacher. I cannot. 
You cannot. Yes, I, I cannot. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, Maria? Uh, yes, I am. I am okay. going to my house. Okay, le voy a mandar entonces al grupo de una vez. Ten, number ten. Number you five see? is number five is for you. Five. Okay. Yeah. Eh, no. Hoy oh, sí la oigo mejor. Eh, me conecté a mis datos. Tal vez así. Tenemos mucho problema. Ya vine, sí. teacher. Hi, teacher. Hello. Aquí ya habíamos tenido unos problemas técnicos con Gloria. Ok, yeah, she told me that she has problems with the internet, I think. Ok. Teacher, uh, we have a confused with... A confusion. With, a confusion with us. Yeah, what is the confusion? Uh, I think uh, we think that is a make make a, a a conversation. Yesterday you practiced a conversation, right? Do you remember? At the end, you practice a conversation, okay? And uh, you had problems to explain the procedure to request a permission in the conversation. So I said at the end, I said al final yo dije. Escriban el proceso para, para pedir un permiso, to ask for a permission, because you will use it in the conversation, porque lo van a usar en la conversación. Ah, yeah. okay. Yes, it's that conversation. Mm -hmm. Ah, ok. Yeah. Uh, once a... Uno de los dos vamos a usar para la conversación. Yeah, yeah. Or you can switch. Ah. Pueden cambiar roles. You can switch roles, ok. Ah, ok. Yeah. I, mm -hmm. Ok, I get it. Ok. Bye. Hello, Margarita. Sorry, I was trying to, to solve different problems. I'm sorry. Okay, I talked I talk to Flor in this uh, a moment ago, and she said that she can work in this moment. She can participate oh. in the activity. Okay, so what you can do is that you can create the conversation, okay. and maybe someone can help you. Okay. Uh, bueno, te lo diré en español. I, Como I, es igual que la que la del libro, yeah. solo el proceso, le leo el proceso. That's right, that's right. That's the only thing we okay. need. When I start at work, the human resource assistant give me a form in Excel. Okay. And explain it that if I need a permission, first I say my boss the reason for the permissions, then fill out the form and write the time and day I will be absent. If I need one day complete for less two days before, I have to give the form my boss. Okay. So you have to give the permission before? Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. I ah, okay. Uh, if I need one day complete for less two days before, at least I have say, at to least. give. At least uh, two days before. At, at least. least. Uh, at least. Ah, uh, okay. Y, y tengo que decir I need one day complete o solo diciendo one day se sobreentiende que es día completo. Yeah, because you are talking about the permission. You only say if I need one day off, you can say if I need one day off. It's better. Ah, one day off. Ah, off. Okay. We double F. Off. Okay. Off. We double okay. F. <clears throat> if I need one day off at least two days before, at I least. have to give this. At least. At, ah, at, digo at, less. <laughs> at least. Okay. At least. At least. At least two days before, I have to give the form my boss. The format. The form. You the mean form? the form? The form to my boss. To. The, ah, to my boss. To my boss. Yes. The to form my boss. to my boss. Yes. Okay. Yeah, it's okay. Let me go to help us mean because he's asking for help. Okay. Let's go. It's fine.
Okay, los. Who is your partner, Rosmin? Uh, yes, the uh, Sandra. Sandra, exactly. Pero she said she's sick. <laughs> yes, yeah, she told me. She said she's sick. She is connected, but she's very sick. Yeah. Sick. So what you can do is that maybe you can, uh, did you write the, the procedure? Escribió el procedimiento? Yes. Did you write the procedure? Yes, yes. yes I procedure. Can you read it? Can you read it, please, so I listen to you? Okay. Number one. Yeah. Fill out the permit. Okay. Farm. The permission. You say the permission. Fill out the permission. Step, step for request permission. Okay. Number two. Uh, present it to the supervisor to sing it. And then, and number three, uh, the supervisor will send you to uh, human resource. Yeah. yeah. Only that. Oh, do that. Yeah. Okay. Right. Okay. Thank you. It's okay, Osmin. Thank you very much. Okay. So maybe somebody can help you. Tal vez alguien le, alguien le, alguien le puede ayudar, okay? Okay. Thank you. All right. Thank you. ¿Quién va a decir? Aquí. Aquí, independientemente de quién diga eh, el primer eh, respuesta, ¿qué más uh -huh. diría la otra? Ok. ¿Sale? Con el nombre ahí nomás, porque ahí, ahí solo va number. Name. You name. Ada. Wow. Noah. Um, okay. Antes de Se poner pensé, thank you, ahí tiene que poner Ada. Uh -huh. okay. Y abajo también ponga a Salia, porque a Salia también le va a contestar algo. Gracias, Mr. Sánchez. O sea, okay. abajo de abajo de Ada, vuelve a repetir eso o que otro saludo para usted a salir. ¿Qué más? ¿Salia? Ah, mentira. <risa> quizá, lo, quizá lo mismo, porque. Oh, o sea, ve, las do, oh. la dos, una cada una, una vez cada una. Thank you, thank you. Ve, hasta ahí digamos que estamos bien. Um, ahora, eh, esa, usted pregunta eso, yo le contesto, no, no, Jetsy. Y a Salia le contesta, ¿nos puede explicar, por favor, algo así? Uh -huh. Yes. No. Are you ready? Um, no, can you? Yes. No, can you explain to use, please? To use um, what? Use, please. Uh -huh, but what do you want me to explain? ¿Qué quiere que les explique específicamente? What do you want me to explain specifically? Este, disculpe mi, mi español. The conversation to, to users. Uh -huh. Yeah, you have the conversation but, on, the, on uh, the menu. I need three. <laughs> ah, you but, need three. Uh, but, uh, uh, we, uh, <laughs> you, we need, we need uh, uh, participate the three user. No, no, it, I mean, don't complicate the, yourself. In the, in the, in the don't, don't complicate yourselves, okay? Just do it with two, okay? And you decide who presents. Ustedes deciden quién presenta. Solo hagan en parejas. Solo hagan para dos personas. Si no se van a complicar. If not, you will get, ah. and we don't have, and we don't have so much time. Y no tenemos mucho tiempo. We don't have so much time, okay? <clears throat> okay. Entonces, borra todo. Borra la que es. Bórrame a mí. It's the, same, it's the same conversation, okay? It's the same conversation. 
The only thing that is different is the last part. Lo único que es diferente es la última parte de la conversación que está en el manual, from the conversation with the manual, ¿ok? okay. Ah, bueno, entonces ahí a uh, una dos. Borre la de arriba. Pregunta. Good afternoon, ladies. Que ponga good afternoon, Ada. Arriba. A salida. Entonces, pues lo que podemos hacer es decir dos cada uno o usted solo usted dice la última sí. parte para que participe. Sí. Oh, no, okay. pero no es hay comeback, sino que I will be back later. later. Uh -huh. I will be back later. Okay. Right. Again. Okay. Change, change the rules or? Okay. Uh, good afternoon, Miguel, and welcome to our company. Thank you, Miss Sulma. Do you know the procedures and rules of our company? No, not yet, Miss. Okay. Where do you want to start? What about how to request a permission? Sounds good. I will explain them to you. First, you explain the then fill a form, then fill a form in, in internet and send to human resources. And finally, human resources authorize. Okay. So are you ready? Yes. yes. Okay. Yes. That's perfect. Okay. Okay. Excellent. Ya se fue Zulma. Yes. La asustó. La asustó. No, no. It's, it's, it's time, actually. Mm -hmm. Okay. Who has problems? Who has problems? The internet. Ah, okay. Osmin has problems with the internet. Okay. All right, so did everyone finish? Yes, yes, yes. teacher. Yes. Yes, All right. Teacher. Basically, the conversation is the same conversation that is on the manual, right? Maybe the difference is at the end, that at the end, you have to add or put the procedure to request a permission, okay? That is the only difference. Esa es la única diferencia. And use the names, and to use your names, okay? Usar sus nombres, and to use your names okay all right short hair short hair okay let me see who has short hair here from the ladies okay let me see oh rosa rosa has short hair ¿Quién más tiene cabello corto de las damas? who else has short hair only rosa margarita i don't yes. see your camera on only okay, Jancy, only only rosa Today I have longer. Lucky like, like you then, lucky like you. All right, so uh, Rosa, who is your partner? Uh, Mayra. Mayra, all right. Okay, we listen to you. Mayra, are you okay. ready? Yes. Yes. Okay, go ahead. Good afternoon, Rosalena, and welcome to our company. Thank you, Mayra. Do you know the procedure and rules of our company? No, no yet. Okay, where do you want to start? What about how to request a permission? Sounds good. I will to explain them to you. First, print the request form that is available on the CRM. Second, fill out the form. Third, Complete the information required by the form. Next, sign the form. And after that, bring the form to your boss to sign. And with the signature of your boss, the request is approved. And that is all. Okay, thank you. There are many steps I hope to remember. Them. No, <laughs> no problem. The, proce the procedure is in the CRM. Ah, okay, thank you. You're I like welcome. Thank you. Nice, I like it. Thank you very much. That's really a procedure, right? Okay, thank you. Thank you, Mayra. Thank you, Rosa. So, congrats. Thank you very much. Excellent. Great work. Okay, congrats. Good. Now, let me think about earrings. Earrings. 
who has or who is wearing earrings? ¿Quiénes andan aretes aquí? From the ladies. Los chicos esperen un momento, ok? Ya nos vamos a arreglar. <laughs> ok, go. Me, teacher, but, but Flor don't in class. Flor don't is not. Don't Flor is, wasn't. Is not. Wasn't. Is, she is in class, but she is, uh, I think she is at work, okay? She is in class, okay. but she is at work, okay? That's why she can participate in the activity, okay? But if you want, I can help you. No problem. Or maybe uh, somebody else can help you. Maybe Rosa, Rosa finished. So maybe Rosa can help you. Rosa, hello. I don't see Rosa. Where are you, Rosa? I think she left the class. No. Or Mayra. The okay. other person. Mayra, Mayra can help you, right? <laughs> so Mayra, maybe you can be the... the Ashley. Oh, that's right. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, permítame. Tengo que ver la conversación. Ok. The page. Page 43. Did you find it? ¿Ya la encontraron? Did okay. you find it? Oh, okay. Good afternoon. Ok. Good afternoon, Mayra. And welcome to to our company. Thank you, Margarita. Do you know the procedures and rules of our company? No, no yet. Okay, where do you want to start? What about how to request a permission? Sounds good. I will explain them to you first. Uh, you say to boss the reason for the permissions, then write the time and day I will be absent. If you need one day off, at least two days before, you have to give the form to your boss, just formally, only that. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, excellent. Thank you very much, uh, Margarita and Mayra. Thanks, thank, you for, Mayra. thank you for your help, okay? Good, so excellent. Great job, okay? Thank you very much for your presentation. Sulma, it's me or you have earrings? <laughs> yes, me. I have earrings. Ah, she was very quiet, right? <laughs> Good. I said girls who have earrings will present, okay? So, uh, Sulma, who are your, plus, your classmates? Or who is your partner? Um, Miguel. Miguel, all right. So go ahead. Ready, teacher. It is me. Okay. Good afternoon, Sulma, and welcome to our company. Thank you, Mr. Miguel. Do you want the do you do you know the procedures and roles are of our company? No, not yet, sir. Okay, where do you want to start? What about how to request a permission? Sounds good. I will explain things to you. First, you explain the situation to your boss. If your boss accepted, then fill a form and internet and send to human resource. And finally, human resource authorize. Authorize. Sorry. Authorizes. Okay. It's only, that's all. Only that. Okay. Thank you very much. Okay. Thank you. Fantastic. Great. Okay. I like the procedure. Thank you very much. Miguel and company. All right. And Sulma, right? Thank you very much. Very good. So who else is wearing earrings? King Mahandaretes. Who else is wearing earrings? Nobody. Michelle, are you wearing earrings? You don't have earrings. Yes, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. Why are you so quiet? <laughs> okay, yes. Michelle, who is your partner? Uh, Angela. All right, Angela is connected. <laughs> Angela, do you have earrings? Yes. Are you wearing earrings, Angela? Are you wearing no. earrings? No, oh, I'm sorry, but Michelle is. Okay. No, no. 
<laughs> or pandemic. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry, but Michelle is wearing earrings. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry for you. Okay. <laughs> es que así decía que no había que usar. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, I'll start. Mm -hmm. Good afternoon, Angela, and welcome to our company. Good afternoon. Thank you, Michelle. Do you know the procedures and rules of our company? No, not yet, miss. Okay, where do you want to start? What about how to re request a permission? Okay, sounds good. I will explain, explain them to you. First, uh, go to the intranet. After, select the days you will take. Then specify the reason why you take the days. After you complete the request, you will receive an email. And finally, at the same time you receive an e the email, your boss will receive the request that he should approve. If your boss doesn't approve, you cannot take the days. Thank you, Michelle. You're welcome, Angela. What a procedure. Thank you very much, Anna, Michelle, and Angela. So congrats. Thank you very much. Congratulations. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you for your participation. Good. Uh, now, do we have any volunteers? Do we have any volunteers? No volunteers? No. All right. One. And... Sorry? Okay. <laughs> uh... Me, Adriana, and Jans. Okay, go ahead. Okay. Uh, good afternoon, Adriana, and welcome to our company. Thank you, Miss Jansi. Do you know the procedures and rules of our company? No, no, Jansi. What would you like to know? Uh, what about how to request a permission? Uh, okay, the first step is request the form, the form from human resource. Second, fill out the form. Then, import and request authorization from the boss. And finally, present a uh, human resource staff. Oh, thank you, Ms. Jansi. I'd like to help you. Nice, interesting. Thank you very much, Jansi and Adriana. So, excellent. Okay, great job. Thank you very much, okay, for your uh, presentation. Okay, so do we have any other pair of volunteers or no more volunteers? Do we have more volunteers? No? Or yes? Or yes? Or yes? No. All right, very good. So, uh, thank you very much for the people who presenting. Thank you. Hey, thank teacher. You. Oh, Nelson, I'm sorry. Okay, Nelson, who is your partner? Yeah. Uh, Patricia. Okay. Okay. Ada, hello. Uh, yeah. Okay. Ready, Ada? Yes. Good afternoon, Ada. And welcome yes, to Nelson. Good afternoon, Ada. And welcome to your the company. Thank you, Mr. Nelson. Do you know the procedure and rule in your company? No, not yet, Mr. Nelson. Okay. Where do you want to start? What about how to request a permission? Sounds good. Uh, I will explain them to you. First, I connected to a server in the cloud. Then you have to fill out the form explaining the reason for the permits in the days of the permit. Then next, I send I send it to my boss and the area, the manager, and you have to wait for them to give you the authorization. And infinite. Is the, is the... Yes, finish. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, thank you for your presentation. 
Uh, fantastic. Okay, great job. Thank you, Nelson and Ada, Patricia. Good. Now, I have a question for everybody, like in general, okay? A question for everybody. Uh, the question is, uh, who completes the permission forms online? Who completes permission forms online? Like on Me? the cloud or, okay, uh, Nelson, who else? Me. Okay, Rosa, who else? Yes. And Margarita, I think, right? No? Margarita? Yes, teacher. Yes, all right. Uh, who else? Who else? Who else? Only them? Me. All right, almost like, like half, right? Casi la mitad, almost half. All right, very good. Thank you very much. Now, uh, let's go to the next activity. And in the next activity, uh, we also, uh, we always, sorry, we always have uh, some, some discussion, discussion questions, right? And this time the questions are the following, okay? So question number one is, what happens if an employee in your company shows up late? What is shows up? What is shows up? Se presenta tarde. Teacher, no lo escuchamos. Sorry, exactly. So, what happens if an employee in your company shows up late? It's like llega tarde, okay? Mm -hmm. O se presenta tarde, shows up late. What do you do when you are sick and can't work? So, when you are sick and you can't work, what do you do? All right? Don't tell me in this moment, okay? Just take like three minutes or four minutes to answer the questions, okay? Go ahead. So, please, on your notebook, answer the two questions. Uh, these questions are on page number 45, okay? So if you have the, the photocopy, the questions are on page 45. <clears throat> maybe yes just to give you some examples right imagine question number one what happens if an employee in your company shows up late maybe you can say he receives a warning or the boss closes the door i don't know right or uh, he has to, or, or he has a, a discount in the salary, okay? He gets a discount in the salary. I don't know, okay? So you need to write the reasons, okay? Or what happens if this, okay, uh, takes place in the company. And for the second question, what do you do when you are sick and can't work? Maybe you say, I have to go to work anyways, or I need to, or I can get a permission, or I can go to the doctor, I don't know, all right? So it's your, it's your answer, it's about you, right? It's about the place where you work.
Okay, I'll give you one minute. Or are you ready? Are you ready? Or you are still completing? Okay, Margarita is ready. Okay, so say almost, almost. Or you say almost. Almost. Almost, <laughs> almost ready. You can say almost ready. Almost ready. All right, so ready? take one. All right, take one minute and then we go to, to practice, okay? Okay, um, I'm sorry, the minute is over, all right? So uh, the questions are on page number 45, okay? Question number one, let's see the pronunciation. Okay, seré tu interpret. Question, question number one is, uh, what happens if an employee in your company shows up late, shows up, shows up late, okay? What happens if an employee in your company shows up late? Question number two, what do you do when you are sick and can't work? What do you do when you are sick and can't work? Okay, very good. Now listen, um, for this activity, the breakout rooms will be bigger, okay? So the idea is that you take turns asking the questions, okay? Uh, Margarita, imagine Margarita works with Ana Michelle, Adriana and Angela. So Margarita can ask Michelle, Michelle can ask uh, Adriana, Adriana can ask Angela and Angela can ask Margarita, so you made like a circle asking the questions, okay? Yeah? Yes, teacher. Okay, perfect. So let's go to practice then. I will give you like uh, four minutes for this activity, okay? Okay, let's go to practice. <sighs> Who start? Who start? Me? Okay. Okay. I will ask you, Miguel. Okay. Excellent. What happens if. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> no, no problem. What happens if an employee in your company shows up late? Okay. A payroll discount is made. Wow, really? Yes. Wow. And 
What do you do when you are sick and can't work? I go to the doctor and take the medicine and rest. Okay. Okay. Uh, I ask to uh, Asalia Melanie. Okay. Yes. I ask, uh, what happens if an employee in your company shows up, shows up late? They can leave. They can leave as some sanction as uh, as you to return home or not let you go to the office. Okay. Excellent. What do you do when you are sick and can't work? I call my my media boss and inform him of my situation. Then I present a certificate. Okay, okay. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Okay, thank you, Rosalie. Do you ask? Asali, do you ask? Uh, Ophelia. Mm -hmm. Okay. What? My co-worker receive, receive a sanction if not present a justification. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Question. Question number two. Yes. The Angela, what do you do when you are sick and can work? I report to my immediate boss through a phone call. That's it. Yes, <laughs> that's it. Es que así es, no es muy bueno. Y my company too. <laughs> ajá, me, porque me, como, me. Eh, ajá, como, digamos que, bueno, en mi caso, Eh, no sé faltar, digamos, de enfermarme, digamos, por una gripe no dejo de, no voy al seguro, ni tampoco falta, ¿verdad? <risa> Salvo que ahora por el COVID sí, porque hoy sí nos han prohibido, si alguien anda con gripe, hoy sí, lo, por, por todo, por las precauciones que vamos a tomar, pero antes no era así. <risa> ok. Vaya. A, a Glorita, ¿verdad? Yes. Glorita, what do you do when you are sick and cannot work? In my company, it is necessary to present medical disability, but there is a joke. Okay. Yes. Uh, what do you do when you are sick? And can work? In my case, <laughs> um, I am boss. <laughs> I don't have, I, I don't have to report um, this analysis. Estoy teniendo muchos problemas con el, con el internet y me está sacar y meter y más sacar y meter. Eh, a la sesión, entonces muy probable que no pueda participar con ustedes, aunque yo voy a hacer un intento. Ok, no problem, Ana Patricia. Ok, continue. Eh, in my case, eh, rarity, rarity is eh, one per year is a show shut up later, but eh, 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 and normally is is a time but when i i have mm, uh, when, when i have when case uh, the boss told with the employee and and give a warning it's, it's running uh, for me in my case uh, today uh, I have to be in company in other day, I work at home. 
uh, remotely, but uh, only only check my my attend is when I connect it um, on the server or in, internet the, the, the company. No, it's rarely is a show shut up later. No problem. Okay. What do you do when you are sick and can't work? Uh -huh. Well, depend. it depends. That's kind. Uh, Islands, illness. Uh, I have cause it, it's common flu. Uh, I go to home, uh, I go to bed. Um, um, uh, or or hours, uh, I watch TV. Yes. Mm. Yes. yes. When I don't I understand that finally, Nelson. What? Who is that? I watch TV. <laughs> yes, when when I have when when I sick and, and I have it in my in my in my in my home in my home. Oh. Yes. No, because uh, when when the, I have the, the permission, uh, I sick where and I call my boss. Okay. It depends on the case. When, okay. uh, it, doesn't, it doesn't matter. I have to work. Me dijo, be regular. Yes. <laughs> My God. Okay, Jancy, ask, ask okay. I don't know who. Oh, Adriana. Okay. What happens if an employee in your company shows up late? In my company, uh, the old employees um, have 15 minutes to be late. In the case that administrative employees and no problem, no problem to arrive if, uh -huh, if um, going to be late, no problem. If they, if they arrive late. Uh-huh. Mm. Why? Mm. No, I can't. No sé si lo anoté, pero no marcamos. ¿Cómo se dice? Ajá, no marcamos. Ajá, don't, 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 don't register. Ajá. Don't, don't, ajá. The time, the entry time. Ajá. I think. Contra. Don't register right the entry Contra. time. Mm -hmm. In the case that employees, the production, um, yes, uh, you are the dude, the dude for your salary. When mm -hmm. the payroll. When I uh -huh, show up ah. late. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Uh, second question: What what do you do when are you are sick and can't work? The first. Uh, Call, call my boss. I call my boss, and he say, depends the situation. Because, uh, I am very bad. Uh, I go to see the doctor, and you know. But if if you are at the company and you feel sick. At the moment, maybe at the middle of the of the journal, oh, I have fever. I feel bad. What do you do? What do you, what do, you do? You continue working. Um, you say I have to go because I have fever. <laughs> and the and the company um, uh, there is the clinic. There is a clinic. There is a clinic. Okay. Uh, and 
you go to the clinic. You go to the clinic. And the doctor say, oh, and you're okay, continue. Go, uh -huh. Or uh, go to, to go the, to the house. house. Go to the house. Okay. It's good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. And the question. Okay. Eh, Margarita. What happens if an employee in your company show 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 a plate? In my case, in the company, not exist the rule of registering the entry time. But if some employee show up late frequently, he receive a warning. Only talk with the person. In the company, the most employees use the company's bus, bus, company's mm -hmm. bus, so they mm -hmm. arrive early in the morning. Mm -hmm. In other areas, areas like marketing, don't have entry time. Okay. What do you do when you are sick and can work? Well, first I call to boss, explain them what I feel. Then I call the business clinic and talk with the general doctor who decide if I will to go this or rest in my house. Okay, thank you. <laughs> okay, uh, Osmin. Are you participating? He said he's uh, having connection. No, ah. I have problem with the oh, internet. Okay. He yes. has problem connection. Okay. Mm. Finish, teacher. Finish, teacher. <laughs> you finished? Finish. Right on yes. time. Yes. Right on time. <laughs> All right. Let's go back then. Okay. Okay, let's wait for the others because I imagine the others are practicing in this moment. Okay, so let's wait for them. They still have like 20 or 30 seconds, I think. Okay, so let's wait. Let's be patient. <laughs> they are enjoying the, the practicing. Yeah, I, I see. I can see. I think they haven't finished. <laughs> Everybody, now everybody's coming back. <clears throat> Only one group is missing, I think. Let me see who it is. I, they're coming. <clears throat> yeah. Now they're back. All right, everybody. So uh, thank you very much for uh, taking this space to talk about these important topics, right? Okay, these topics are very important, okay? Now, the, the question is, okay, um, were the answers of your classmates similar to your answers or they are different? Were the answers of your classmates similar to your answers or they are different or they differ a lot? Difieren bastante, they differ a lot. Tell me, Adriana? Similar teacher. They were similar, okay? So basically um, the same things, uh, they do the same things in the companies, in the two companies, yeah? Hacen las mismas cosas, yeah. they, they do the same things. Okay, very good. Thank you, Adriana. Uh, okay, um, whose answers were different? La respuesta de quién fueron diferentes. Whose answers were different or differ? Whose in my case, different? the answer, answer Margarita. The, the answer yes, because, the Margarita. because the marketing personnel doesn't uh, have to, how do you say, punch card? Yeah, to punch. Boosters for patient. Uh -huh. uh -huh. They 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 don't have to register this. 
the entry. The, the entry. Mm -hmm. The entry time. Oh, really? At the, at the company, all the personal, including the marketing person. Okay. In, so my, the, in my company, the uh, some areas like marketing mm -hmm. don't have entry time. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. But what because about... What about the, when they, Margarita, what about when they, when they finish work? Huh? When they go out. <laughs> really, the employees, no, uh, these employees, eh, son de campo, de, de, o sea, oh, de, de, de andar en okay. calle. Yes, I see, I see. All right, I see, I see. All right, mm -hmm. so they, they are Vendedores, not the Vendedores, salesmen, okay. salesmen, general. Okay. Uh -huh. so it's, de marca, no sé it's, cómo se it's not necessary right uh, brand brand manager so it's not necessary for them to i mean the most important brand is to, to achieve or to Trade get the marketing. goal marketing uh -huh. okay to get the goal so, is the most important right mm -hmm. y, alcanzar la meta uh -huh. okay good thank you very much it's very interesting okay thank you very much good so uh, now let me pass the attendance quickly before we go to the conversation okay so uh, say present please Ana, Ada, Patricia? Here. All right, Adriana? Present. Ana, Michelle? Present. Angela? Present, teacher. Asalia? Present. Very good. Darwin? Present, teacher. Flor? She was, she's connected, right? Uh, Gloria? Here. All right. Carla? Present. Margarita? Present. All right. Maria? Present. Mayra? Present. Nelson? Present. All right. Uh, Ophelia? Here, teacher. All right. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Osmin? Here, teacher. All right, Rafael? Present. Here. Good. Rosa? Present. Sandra? No. Here, teacher. no this. I think she's, yeah, but she's connected. Okay, Jansi? Present. Sulma? Sulma? Present. And Miguel? Present, teacher. All right, thank you very much. Good, so let's keep advancing with the activities. And next we have one activity that is known for uh, by everybody, all right? We have this conversation, okay? L check this, this is very important. How is it going? How is it going? So just keep in mind that we have different ways to say, how are you? Okay, we have different ways to say, how are you? So you can say, how are you? How are you doing? In yesterday's conversation, we had, how are you doing, right? How are you doing? How is it going? In this case, how's everything, all right, you can say. So here we have, how is it going, all right? So please listen carefully to the pronunciation, okay? Listen carefully to the pronunciation. Hi, Annie, how is it going? Hello, Brad, I am fine, and you? I am okay, thanks. Look, I want to ask you, what does your boss do when a worker doesn't come to work? Well, if someone doesn't come, my boss calls him or her. And when the person returns, he or she receives a notification or warning. Why, Brad? Well, because I didn't show up to work today. I understand. If you see your boss tomorrow, explain him the situation. Yeah, I think I will do that. Thanks, Annie. Listen again. Hi, Annie, how is it going? Hello, Brad, I am fine, and you? I am okay, thanks. Look, I want to ask you, what does your boss do when a worker doesn't come to work? Well, if someone doesn't come, my boss calls him or her, and when the person returns, he or she receives a notification or warning. Why, Brad? Well, because I didn't show up to work yes, uh, today. I understand. If you see your boss tomorrow, explain him the situation. Yeah, I think I will do that. Thanks, Annie. All right, let's listen to, um, to a pair of students pronouncing the conversation. So let's listen to Sulma and Adriana. Sulma, Brad, 
Okay. Adriana N. All right. Zulma Brad, Adriana N. Okay. Hi, Annie. How is it going? Hello, Brad. I'm fine. You? I'm okay. Thanks. Look, I want to ask you. I want to ask you, what does your boss do when a broker doesn't come to work? Well, if son doesn't come, my boss calls him or her. And when the person returns, he or she receives a notification or warning. And why, Brad? Well, because I didn't show up to work today. I understand. If you see your boss tomorrow, explain him the situation. Yeah, I think I will do that. Thanks, Annie. Okay, yeah. thank you very much. Great, thank you. All right, let's listen to Ada and, and, and Ophelia, all right? Ada, you are Brad, Ophelia, you are Annie. Okay. Hi, Annie, how is it going? Hello, Bran. I finished. And you? I am okay. Thanks. Look, I want to ask you what does your boss do when a worker doesn't come to work? I, I will is so maybe does not. I call me and my boss. I, I call his or her. And when the personal return his or she receives a notification or warning with Brad. Well, because I didn't show up to work today. I understand if you see your box tomorrow, display <coughs> in his the situation. Yeah, I think I will do that. Thank you, uh, Annie. Okay, thanks, Ophelia and Ada. Thank you very much. Okay, let's listen to our last pair. Let's listen to our last pair, two boys. Okay, let's listen to um, Rafael and Miguel. All right, Rafael, you are Brad. And Miguel, you take the role of Annie, all right? Thank you. Hi, Amy. How is it going? Hello, Brad. I am fine. And you? I am okay. Thanks. Look, I want to ask you, what does your boss do when a worker doesn't come to work? Well, if someone doesn't come, my boss calls him or her. And when the person returns, he or she receives a notification or warning. Why, Brad? Well, because I didn't show up to work today. I understand. If you see your boss tomorrow, explain him the situation. Yeah, I think I will do that. Thanks, Annie. All right, thank you. That's excellent. Thank you very much. All right, now let's listen to another pair of girls. Okay, so let's listen to uh, Jancy and... Rosa, okay, Jancy, you are Brad, and Rosa, you are Annie. Hey. Hi, Annie. How are you doing, Brian? Hello, Brad. I'm fine. And you? I am okay. Thanks. Look, I went to ask you what does your boss do when I work and doesn't come to work? Well, if someone doesn't come, my boss call him or her. And when the boss returns, he or she receives a notification or warning. Why, Brad? Well, because I didn't shut up, show up to work today. I understand. If you see your boss tomorrow, explain him the situation. Yes, I think I agree to that. Thanks, Annie. Okay, thank you. That's excellent. Thank you very much for your participations, okay? I appreciate it. Now, look, here we have some sentences 
or questions and they are disorganized, okay? We need to organize the words to make questions or sentences according to the conversation, okay? So this is according to the conversation. For example, number one, how would, how would it stay? Number one, ¿cómo quedaría la número uno? How would number one stay? I think it's on the conversation, right? Maybe she receives a notification when the employee arrives. Mm -hmm. Change the order. And when? When the employee arrives, she receives a notification. Good, I like it. More, uh, it's much better. Okay, it's mucho mejor. It's much better. So uh, when an employee, when the when the employee um, arrives, what you said? Arrives, he she or receives. she, she receives she receives uh -huh. a notification. Under yes, that's correct. Okay, so when the employee arrives, he she receives a notification. Sorry, she. She receives a notification. Very good, that's excellent. Thank you very much. Check number two. Organize the words to make a question. Number two, a question, right? This is a question. You can check the conversation here. What does your boss do when a worker doesn't go to work? Mm, excellent. What does, what does your boss do when a worker Uh, doesn't doesn't you say? go to work. Doesn't go to work. Okay, very good. That's excellent. Okay. What does your boss do when a worker doesn't go to work? I I am going to wait for you because I can see you are taking notes. Okay. Veo que están tomando notas algunos. So I will wait for you to finish. And then we go to number three. Okay. Ready? So number two is what does your boss your boss do when a worker doesn't go to work? Okay. Let's see number three. I call my boss. I don't show up to work. If and if if I don't show up to work. If I don't show up to work, yeah? Yes. Yeah? Uh -huh. Okay, say the whole sentence. Digan la oración completa, say the whole sentence. I call my boss if I shop up, if I don't shop up work. Yeah, that's, that's work. correct, okay? So I call my boss if I don't show up to work. That's excellent, okay? So I call, my boss, if I don't show up to work. Okay, that's excellent, very good. Okay, so you Teacher, can complete. Can you repeat the second? The second, what does, yeah, that, that's what they say. What does your boss do when a worker doesn't go to work? What does your boss do when a worker doesn't go to work? Doesn't go to work, okay? Thank you. All right, no problem, no problema. What does your boss do? What does your boss do when a worker doesn't go to work, okay? Okay, so did you finish? Yeah. Okay, listen. Here on these sentences, I want you to pay attention to the word when and to the word if. Okay, so please pay attention to the words when and if. And let's go to the conversation. As you can see here, you have one example, right? What does... Okay, so here you have one example. What does your boss do when a worker doesn't come to work. I have a question for you, okay? On this, how many sentences do you have? ¿Cuántas oraciones tienen? How many sentences do you have on this?
in this part, okay, in this part, how many sentences do you have? Two, two sentences. Two, two, two all right, two. Um, yeah, it's, it's one sentence, you are correct. It's one compound sentence, by the way. It's one compound sentence. Es una oración compuesta, but you have two clauses. Tienen dos clausulas. What does your boss do in? A worker doesn't come to work, okay? You have two clauses, dos clausulas. And the two clauses are being connected with when, okay? Gwen está conectando las dos cláusulas. Okay, very good. Now check this. If someone doesn't come, my boss calls him or her. How many clauses do you have? ¿Cuántas cláusulas hay? How many One. clauses? One or clauses, cláusulas. Not sentences, two. clauses. Two clauses. Yeah. Two, 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 two. Number one is someone doesn't if. come. And num number one is someone doesn't my, come. And number two, my boss, my boss calls my him boss. or her. her. And if is connecting the two clauses, all right? But you tell me, but a teacher, but it's at the beginning. How is it that it is connecting? Está al principio, ¿cómo es eso que está conectando? Oh, yeah. You can use when and if at the beginning, okay? Pueden usarlo al principio, but you put a comma to separate, okay? But you put a comma to separate the two clauses. Si lo usamos al principio, el bueno o el if, ponemos una coma para separar las dos cláusulas, ¿ok? But if you use it in the middle, no coma is necessary. Si van en medio, no es necesaria la coma. The coma is not necessary, ¿ok? Now let's see another sure. example. Yeah. <coughs> o yeah. sea que se puede poner al principio y en, y en medio están también. That's right. Las cosas son válidas. Yes, yes. The only difference okay. is that when you put it at the beginning, Cuando lo ponen al principio, you put a comma to separate the classes, okay? Ponemos una coma para separar las cláusulas. When it's at the beginning, cuando va al principio, okay? Yeah. Now let's see another example. Um, it says, when the, when the person returns, look, comma, porque lo estamos usando al principio, when the person returns, he or she receives a notification or warning, two clauses, right? And they are being connected with when. And the last example here, el último ejemplo. The last example here. If you see your boss tomorrow, explain him the situation. So if, <clears throat> and we have the comma here, okay? If you see your boss tomorrow, comma, explain him the situation, okay? The second clause, la segunda clausula, the second clause. All right. And this is the topic basically for, 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 for today, okay? So this, Okay, let me show you here. So these, uh, these are if and when to join classes. Usando el if y el when para unir cláusulas, to join classes, okay? What is the meaning of if? ¿Qué significa if? What is the meaning of if? Sí. Sí. Sí, sí, right? Sí. Para una, sí. para una causa y efecto, digamos, okay? For, C is a cause, and we have an effect, okay? Mm -hmm. And we have some examples here. So check, out, check this example. What do you do when you forget your tools for work? Ah, what do you do when you forget your tools for work? Or I can tell you, uh, okay, guys, or okay, people, what do you do when, when you see a gossip in the company? Or what do you do when your boss um, doesn't go to work, okay? I don't know, okay? When your boss doesn't go to work. Number two, I ask for a backup set when I forget my tools, okay? Here is in the middle, aquí está en medio. I ask for a, for a backup set when I forget my tools, all right? Next, when I forget my tools, look at this. Here is at the beginning, okay? Dos cláusulas. When I forget my tools, comma, I ask for a backup set okay so when is cuando obviously right now using if what do you do if you miss the company transportation i mean if you don't make it on time for the for the transportation of the company what do you do if next i call a taxi if i miss the company transportation the solution right and if at the beginning if i miss the company transportation comma I call a taxi, two clauses, dos clausulas, okay? Two clauses. Now I, I, I ask you, do you have any question about this topic? Yes. 
So it's basically connecting clauses using when and using if, okay? Yeah, connecting clauses using when and if. Do you have any question about this topic? No, teacher. No, it's clear? No, yes, teacher. All right, it's, it's like, imagine I ask you, what do you do when you are sick? What do you do when you are sick? Uh, Yo tengo dudas cuando se usa when you is. Okay, tell me. What are your doubts? ¿Cuáles son las dudas? What are your doubts? Eh, porque bien puedo decir cuando olvido tal cosa, hago, hago esto. Yes. Y, o sea, y puedo decir si olvido esto, ¿cuál es la diferencia? It's the same purpose. It's the same purpose. <laughs> Es el mismo propósito. It's the same purpose, okay? okay. To connect. It's the same okay. purpose, okay? Good. Now, okay. if I don't, so if I ask you, what do you do when you are sick? What is your answer? If I feel really bad, I go to the doctor. You go to the doctor. Very good. What do you do if you are as sick as a dog? <laughs> Miguel? When my dog... I take... Okay. <laughs> okay, Miguel and then Margarita. Margarita. Okay, Margarita. I take person. the medicine. Oh, okay. Miguel, 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 go ahead. I, I take... <laughs> Sorry. I take the medicine and rest. Good, that's excellent. Margarita? When I feel sick, I take medicine. Good, that's excellent. That's very good. Now... I don't know if this has happened to you, but what do you do when you receive a discount on your salary? What do you do when you receive a discount on your salary? If I receive discount in my salary, when I, I, when I, mm, Check no, what? When it's okay. I, I mean, you say when I receive a discount in my salary, I, I, I claim, I continue, I Maria. I, <laughs> I <the> human resource. <laughs> continue, I, Maria. Lo que quería era unir, usar las dos cosas. Si yo recibo, if, if. Yeah, yeah, it's okay. I mean, if I receive a discount in my salary, uh, I, when I... No, no, you don't have to say when. Okay, aquí no puedo decir when, solo digo I. ¿Qué es lo uh, que hago yo? I, 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 I go to speak with my boss. I go to speak with my boss. Excellent. Okay, very good. Aquí no si puedo todo... usar las dos. No, no, no. No, it's not possible. In this case, it's not possible, okay? So here everybody will give examples, I think, right? Porque no quieren que les descuenten. Así que todos van a dar ejemplos, creo. <laughs> All right, I'm kidding. All right, let's see. Uh, now, another situation. Um, what do you do if your cell phone, what do you do if your cell phone breaks? What do you do if your cell phone breaks? I'm going to die. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to I'm die. Going to... <laughs> you die. <laughs> yeah, I die. <laughs> uh, Rafael, what do you do if your cell phone breaks? Only cry. <laughs> you cry. And I, and I will say, don't you cry tonight. <laughs> All right, very good. Uh, now, Another situation. Um, what do you do if your boss doesn't go to work? I call him and I ask, I ask him, what happened with you, boss? <laughs> you call him and you ask, hey, what's going on? Come on, you have to be yes, here. What's right? happening? Make, make a party. Ah, okay. <laughs> to make a party. <laughs> <laughs> hmm, interesting. All right, very good. 
So the, the idea is um, that we use when and if to connect sentences, right? Or sorry, to connect clauses, not sentences, okay? To connect two clauses or more, okay? And remember, if we use when and if at the beginning, we separate the clauses with commas, all right? For example, when I feel sick, comma, I take medicine, all right? So you put the comma, okay? Or you can say, um, if I need a permission, if I need a permission, I put the comma, comma, um, I fill out the form uh, on the internet, okay? Yeah, very good. Now, now that you understand the topic, I have work for you, okay? So, listen, you will take a moment and you will write a short paragraph about policies and procedures at your workplace. The idea is that you use if and when, okay? Para escribir el párrafo van a usar if y van a usar when, all right? Yeah? Y cuando terminen lo van a enviar al chat, aquí. You will send it to the chat here. Okay? Let me give you one example. Let me give you one example. Because it's about policies and procedures, okay? For example, you say, if I get a warning from my boss, if I get a warning from my boss, um, I behave, me comporto, I behave, all right? Or maybe you can say um, about, a, about another policy. When I get to work late or when I go to work late, I talk to my boss, for example, okay? Yeah. Is it clear? Está claro que lo que van a hacer? Is it clear what you're going to do? Yes, yes no? teacher. Okay, just, just a suggestion. No yes. son oraciones las que van a hacer, es un párrafo. Un párrafo es todo seguido. No son oraciones, number one, number two, no. It's a paragraph, es un párrafo, okay? ¿De cuántas líneas? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven lines, de siete líneas, okay? Yeah. Any question? No? No. No. All right. If you have the photocopy, if you have the photocopy, oh, listen to my example. I am using if. Okay. I am using if. If you have the photocopy, the activity is on page 46. Okay. If you have the photocopy. Okay. In this case, I can say when. In este caso, no puedo decir el when. Para quien preguntaba cuál era la diferencia. If you have the photocopy, si tienen la fotocopia, no puedo decir when you have the photocopy, right? Yeah? Okay. So, 15 minutes. Cameras on. Cámaras encendidas porque necesito verlos trabajando a todos. Okay, I need to see you working. Teacher, it's uh, only one paragraph. One paragraph, seven lines. Okay. One paragraph, seven lines. Okay, the siete líneas. One paragraph of seven lines. About policies and procedures. Okay, different procedures.
Ah, so please, when you finish, you send it to the chat, okay? Cuando terminen, lo envían al chat. When you finish, you send it to the chat, please. All right? So I see your work.
I am reading your paragraphs in this moment, okay? I can see some people wrote in past. They'll... Sorry, I can see some people wrote in past. Veo que algunos escribieron en pasado. Uh, Margarita, don't forget the comma when you use if or when at the beginning, okay? If you need a day off, comma, you could fill out the form and explain your boss, okay? So missing the comma, right? That's important here. That comma is important here, okay? Okay, teacher. Uh, right. uh, write this again? again? No, no, no. No, 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 it's okay. Uh -huh. It's unnecessary. Just take the, the, the suggestion in consideration, okay? Ah, uh, okay. Let's see, Maria's. If I am sick, I call my boss for explaining the reason. When I return to work, I have to present a medical certificate if necessary. I fill out the form. Okay, very good. It's excellent. Uh, don't forget that when you use I, you use it with capital, with capital letter. Okay, cuando usamos el I, siempre va en mayúscula donde vaya. Okay? It doesn't matter where you use it. Yeah? Okay, thank you. Okay. The same for Rosa, when you use when at the beginning, you separate with commas, all right? Or if at the beginning. For example, when he or she arrives to the office, comma, all right, Rosa, she has to fill out a form, okay? You're missing she there, Rosa. Yeah, you get it? Okay, teacher. Okay, right. yeah, yes. Okay, okay. Okay, let's see another key, one. In this keyboard, I can, I can, I can. Uh, Write commas. Uh, find, find the comma. Ah, okay, okay. I'm sorry. I didn't yes, know. Yes, I have that. I have that problem because. Okay, I'm sorry. It's I didn't so difficult know. that that keyboard. <laughs> okay. Let's see another one. Alguien que me lo está escribiendo separados ahí, así no van a aparecer. Ah, es un solo párrafo. It's one paragraph. Okay. Me lo están enumerando, es Osmin, I think, okay? Osmin is yeah. only one paragraph, uno de un solo, okay? Yeah, excuse me, teacher, excuse me. Okay. Okay, let's see, an initials. <laughs> I have to make a formal request if I want to request my vacation. When it is an emergency, I just write to my boss and ask for permission. Then, at my job, when I have to be present for maintenance in the early morning, I don't show up for work. The next day is perfect, an initial. Very good, excellent. Let's see Asalia. When the internet fails, often in my company, it affects us all. If it is not repaired, maybe here, when you finish, you can use a period, Asalia. When the internet fails, often in my company, it, it, affects, us, it affects us all, period, punto. If it is not repaired, comma, it cannot be printed, comma, all right? Yeah. If the power goes out, it is also impossible to send the emails. Huh? This is for Asalia. Let's see, Rafa's. It's very good. It's very good, Rafa. Thank you very much. I checked Margaritas already, right? Let's see, Glorias. When it rains, what happens in the office? Oh, I like it. This situation is difficult to overcome. If we are late to the company, it does not work. When the boss calls and when we are not there, he gets upset much. <laughs> The same, you have to use more periods, uh, Gloria. Debe, de, debe usar más puntos, okay? Para que tenga más sentido, to make more sense, okay? This is for Gloria. Let's see 
Adam. Okay. The same uh, for Ada, the commas, right? Si usamos el if y el when al principio, separamos las dos cláusulas con commas. For example, if I am late to my, to my company, comma, my boss calls my attention, period. Ahí puede ir un punto. When I arrive at the office, comma, I do not. Ahí el if ya no es necesario. En la segunda, para Ada, for Ada. I do not explain the reason only, okay? When the payday arrives, he will give comma, he will give me the corresponding discount, okay? Very good. Muy bien, creo que algunos no han terminado todavía, right? It's time already, y ya es hora. Okay, listen, but anyways, I, I can check them all right now. Ahorita no lo puedo revisar todos, so I can check them all right now. But the idea is that you post on the discussion forum, okay? La idea es que eso que tienen ahí, si gustan, copienlo ahí en, en el celular, en algún lugar, para que lo tengan solo de copiar y pegar. Y lo van a postear en el foro de discusión. Ahí les voy a poner un apartado, ¿ok? I will leave something there for you to, to comment, ¿ok? So I see them all, para que lo vea todos ahí, porque aquí en el chat se desaparece. In the chat, they disappear, ¿ok? Very good. Ah, so everyone, it's time. And I know some of you are still working. Sé que algunos aún están escribiendo. But it's time, ¿ok? So try to finish it, and you go to the discussion forum, and Upload it, please. Y lo suben ahí al foro de discusión, ¿ok? Yeah. So, do you have any question before we go? Any question before, you, before we go? No. Y recuerden, mañana es último día. Si no han completado plataforma, mañana antes de la clase debe estar completo, incluyendo el examen final, ¿ok? Including the final test, the final term, ¿ok? Yeah. ¿Quién está ahora con la sesión uno a uno? Who has the one-on-one -on -one session today? Rafa, okay, so very good. So everyone, thank you very much for connecting today. It's time, so good night, goodbye, good night, and see you tomorrow, okay? Sweet dreams. Okay, see you, see tomorrow. you tomorrow. Okay, bye-bye. Okay, bye, bye. 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 bye, bye, see you tomorrow. Bye, bye teacher. Bye. Bye, bye. bye, everyone. Bye. Bye, everyone. Okay, Rafa, so this space is for you. I don't want to take your time, okay? Okay, teacher. Um, let me see. I, I want to ask you about the, the anything on someone concepts or words. Okay. For example, uh, what? How do you say nada? Is nothing. Na, how do you say nada? nada. It depends uh -huh. on. Actually, it depends on the context because you could say nothing or anything. All right, nothing or anything. It, uh -huh. it depends on the context. All right. So um, maybe you can say um, okay. in the context, right? You can say um. I did nothing. I did nothing. It's like, no hice nada. Aunque no tengamos el I didn't. Even if we don't say I didn't, okay? I did nothing, okay? Or maybe nothing happened, all right? Nothing happened. In the case of anything, it means nada, but you use it in negative sentences, okay? For example, I didn't do anything. Okay, I didn't do anything. Yo no hice. Nada, is with negative, es con un negativo. But uh, nothing, you can use it with positive. I did nothing, okay? Yo no hice nada, I did nothing, okay? Yeah? Okay. You get it? Yes. Now, um, algunos o algunas. Uh, in this case, is the and... same, okay? For both, okay? For algunos, in Spanish, you say algunos, algunas. But in, in English, you only say some, some, okay, some. But here, there, there is something important here too, okay? In the case of some, because you can use some or any, some or any, all right? Some or any. 
the question is going to use some. We use some with positive sentences, okay? I need some money, for example, or I need some apples, okay? I need some apples. It's positive, right? But if you make a question, you don't say some, you say any, okay? For example, uh, do you need any apples? You say any, not some, okay? Do you need any apples? Any is the same, algunos o algunas, okay? So I repeat, any is for questions and some is for positive sentences, okay? What about the someone and something? Someone is for people and something is for things. I want to tell you something, for example, something. I want to tell you something is a thing, okay? It's a thing, something, a thing, okay? okay? And you can say, I want to tell someone something. Someone is a person. Quiero decirle a, a alguien algo. I want to tell someone something, okay? So someone is a person, alguien. Okay, in this case, something es como decir algo. Algo, exactly, algo. I want to tell you something, quiero contarte algo, okay? Yes? So it's a thing, basically. Es una cosa, básicamente, it's a thing, okay? Okay, teacher, the... The model must, um, if it's done common, uh, yeah. Actually, must is not, I mean, it's used, but it's not very common. Okay, what is common is to you to see have to because it's the same. Okay, if you say, for example, let me see, because basically, must is for obligation, right? Must is for obligation. Okay, for example, uh. You can say, right, I must do the homework uh, today. I must do the homework today. Okay. Or you can say, I have to do the homework today. All right. It's the same purpose. So what is common is to say, I have to. It's more common. Must is not very common, but I mean, but it's used. Pero se usa también. It's used too. All right. Okay. It if I want to use the must, uh, it's the same. Yeah, it, when you say must, it's like saying have to. Uh, I must clean the house, I have to clean the house. It's the same. It's an obligation. Okay. I have to is an obligation. I have to do something, right? And I must is an obligation too. It's the same purpose. Uh, uh, the, the, for example, uh, entregar un documento because in, in the Google Translate, when I I want to know the meaning the entregar, eh, alguna vez sería. ¿Cómo digo algunas veces? Sometimes. Uh, sometimes. Eh, me tira, me pone delivery. No. Yeah, the, the thing is that this word, okay, delivery is entrega, is a noun, is a sustantivo in Spanish, okay, it's different. Okay, delivery. And the verb is deliver. Deliver, okay, deliver. deliver. Deliver is entregar, and delivery is entrega, okay? But in the case, if, if it's a, 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 a form, is give. The thing For is example, that... I... Yeah, continue. I give the form in recruitment. I give, I give reform the, the form in the resource uh, human department. Yeah. Example. Yeah. In this case, you can say give. It's correct. Yes. Yeah. The thing is that deliver is mostly for, let's say, when there is a distance. All right. When there, when there, when there is a considerate distance. Okay. Like to deliver. Mainly you deliver packages. All right. 
uh, for example, you can say you, you need to go and give some documents to what? To another university, for example. So I am going to deliver some documents at US, for example. You can say, right? Or I am going to deliver some documents um, at these offices, all right? So that means I am going to go and deliver, all right? So there's a distance when you use deliver commonly. Mm -hmm. If, for example, in the in the same company, is is better use give the form or give the document. You you give documents. Mm -hmm. Okay, teacher. Creo que alcance el el ochenta por ciento de asistencia. No lo puede ver. Siempre lo pregunto. The problem is that you were signing late sometimes. El problema es que había, estabas, re, entrabas tarde, muchas veces, many times, ¿ok? That's ah, the problem. But, but, I, but I think you did. Eh, Podría revisarlo. Ok, let me check. Ahorita no se puede ver porque como falta el día de mañana todavía. How many days have you missed? ¿Cuántos días ha faltado? Es que creo que solamente... Eh, faltar así completamente creo que ninguno siempre me conectaba una hora o creo ah, ok okay let me, let me let me see quickly para sacarte de la duda de una vez let me see quickly I okay. didn't have this I didn't have this answer for you <laughs> okay let me check Okay, Rafa, right? Veamos, Rafa, let's see, Rafa. Como el de ahora no lo ha cuadrado todavía, ¿ok? Así que no te sabría decir, pero al menos, sí, ya. Sí, con, sí ya, ya tenés el 83%, ¿ok? You have 83% hasta ayer, till yesterday, ¿ok? Ok. Yeah. <laughs> so. <sighs> <laughs> Thank you, teacher. All right, no problem. Thank you for connecting. Okay, good night. Okay, good night. See you tomorrow.